holsters, mags, ammo. <laughs> carry bag. Oh. oh, right here. All right, what's in the case? What's in the case? Uh -huh. Come on. Come on. <laughs> this person was here for a while, maybe? Uh, yes and decided to call me up the morning of the auction to go, now mind you, she's been in an auction every three months for six years. Um, he called me that morning, I was like, nope. I'm like, there's nothing I can do. But, I mean, like I said, there looks, I know there's at least some NASCAR stuff in there. Like I saw some, all sorts of stuff. Yeah, it's such a big unit. Yeah. That's Lord it. only knows what go, how far back it goes as far as the good stuff goes, I could just see what was at the edge of it. Hey everybody, how are we doing today? Robert Zaba Auctioneer, Extraordinaire, Second Sense Auctions, and I was just Jeff, and we drove over eight hours. Five states, most expensive storage unit that day that was for sale, over $5,000, $5,200-some dollars, plus the buyer premium, looking at a $6,000 unit, had to rent a truck one way back, looking at another $1,500, got a lot of money invested, in this unit we made it in this far if you haven't seen the first video gotta check it out hit that thumbs up help the channel share with your friends and this unit definitely over a thousand dollars easily just in the first few feet and it's 28 feet deep there's tons of cases and boxes and who knows what's on here this stuff so high up i gotta figure out a way to reach that and that and that so first thing i'm gonna do is grab out this i think we might use this as our ladder See what we got on this rolling cart. Looks like we got computers, old television, light bulbs, lots of light bulbs, old printer, briefcase. So, books, paperwork. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is good. Vintage video games for computer. Legends of Valor, King's Quest V. This could be worth some good money right here. Railroad Tycoon. So that's not bad. Which way are you going? I'm gonna try to use this to go up. This ought to be fun. I thought you liked it. Anyone, anyone rooting for him to fall? Do a thumbs up or something. Okay. Flips. Oh, <laughs> I wasn't rooting for you. I got, you, I got Thanks, your Jeff. back, buddy. Thanks, just Jeff. Wait, don't oh. drop that. Oh. Case. All right, let's put a couple on the shelf. Sears. Some kind of analyzer. Diagnostic analyzer. I have to plug you in that. I have to plug you into that and analyze you. <laughs> you know what's going to happen. Porta cable, Cirque saw. Rock and roll and ready to go. The good thing is everything I'm touching is worth something. We like that. Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> I didn't jump. I wasn't scared. I'm sure you weren't. Wow. Look at that. Wow. Double router wow. pack. So that's got to be worth 50 bucks or so. Easy. Maybe more. Woo! It's a neat box. It's got to be closed somehow. No locks on it? Oh, look at that. Got a whole flatware set here. Pretty ornate. Yes. I wonder Solid if it's all in bronze there. Thailand. Interesting. More money. Do you see that cart shaking? 
the you're, card you're, on Yeah, you're okay with that? Oh, all right. Maybe. Oh, I'm, I'm all right. Oh, nice. Hold on, I'm down for a minute. Oh. Be good. Boom. Bada bing, Barbie. Brand new. Heart. This is the Elvis. Headless Elvis. Headless Elvis. This head might be able to go back on. Watch this. <laughs> oh, Santa Elvis. Yeah, we got a little brass stand. <laughs> I Love Lucy, episode 45. I was going to try a Lucy impersonation, but impersonation, but I can't do it. Oh, Ricky. That's not right. So, brand new Vogue Jenny dolls down here. A little smashed up. But still, yeah. another box. Let's put that in the box straightener. Yeah. Yeah. How do you climb up this time? I'm not going up there. Come on, just no, I'm, even if I could I can't reach it. Oh. Don't try this at home. Yeah, you you what do I do if you fall? Uh, do I video or help you? Okay. Cash register. Sharp. Rope. Rope. Cotton general all purpose sash. Oh my God. Well, isn't that sashy? Whatever's in here is heavy. I think it's brand new. Yeah, it doesn't look open. Boiler water level control? I have no clue. Let's get this last box now. We'll figure it out. Watch out. Okay. See, it's in this box here. Oh my gosh. Brand new propane. Are they full? Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Those are like 15, 20 bucks a piece. This is a brand new whatever that is. McDonald and Miller. Doing one. Safety solution. Things well. Chicago boiler water level control. So it's worth nothing. It could be worth a hundred dollars, a thousand dollars. No clue. I got a buyer. My old landlord, he's a commercial plumbing. They do all that. Nice. He loves it when I find that stuff. All right. We're working our way over here. Cords for guitars. Amplifiers. And this looks like this is all old video games. PlayStation original. PlayStation. That's what this is. These are all PlayStation games. Now this thing is loaded. How do they sell? They sell good. They're actually going way up. They've been going up in value. So, and the more complete, the more they're going to be worth. These are original PlayStation. There's a whole box full. You just get five bucks a game. You can do the math. How many games are in here? Wow, wow, wow. You want me to do the math? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Looks like a bunch of CDs, I guess. And they're in there. CDs. Let's take a look at one. It's in there, Google Dials. I'm loving that. I'm loving that wreck. Huh. Very strange. What is that? This is for like a, a foot pedal carbon. This is an old, old school. So this is actually worth money more than the typewriter that would have been in here. But it's an effects pedal. So we'll have to look it up. But old effects pedal could be worth $20, could be worth a couple hundred dollars. Empty case. It's a gun case. Just the gun case alone has that. That's another gun case. 
Yeah, he's all awesome. empty again. Yeah, so this is the empty case that you need. This ain't empty. Whatever's in here is heavy. Ho <laughs> ho! It's like some old military tools or something there. This is all tools. First, I thought it was knives again when I first saw it. It's empty gun cases. Wow. Let's find some cool ones. This says Dremel. Dremel's in that. Because the other thing I'm definitely. Fancy sockets. These are all craftsmen. Nice. Bracelet boxes. Valentine's Day decor. Okay, let's see. Oh man. Some bracelet boxes. Too bad. But definitely has some value. It's like ring boxes or something like that. Jewelry boxes. Paid bills? Probably. Paid bills. Paid bills. See so another paid bills. More cases. Whatever that is. It says right there, multi-location analog thermometer. Interesting. No clue. Once again, dollars, twenty dollars, fifty dollars. Silverware. Empty. Empty. Empty briefcase. Snap on stickers. It's all keys. This is locked or not. Is the top empty? Or full you can go. You think? Nope. It's full. Top is full. All kind of stuff up there. This thing. Magellan Navigational. This is like out in the middle of nowhere navigation. Hmm. Might have some value. Might be too old. I'm not sure. Let's see if this key fits up there. Probably not. That's probably why they have a lot. Craftsman. Some good tools in there, actually. Yeah. It's not money. Oh, there you go. We got pneumatic. We got the uh, grinder got pneumatic tools. We got lock cutters. We got most of almost everything we need to get into that safe. <laughs> All right. What we got here? We got old newspaper, 1994. Oh, look at that. Clock. Looks like it's brand new in the box. Gotta be worth a few bucks. Pine Schoolhouse clock. I like it. Man, there's, <laughs> look at all those tools right there. This show. That's a lot of tools. There's cases on underneath. Oh, right here. Brand new sealed models. Woo! All kinds of stuff right here. It's a skill level three, probably worth more money than monogram. You just look up $63.91. So maybe $20, $50 set. I'm not sure, but we got two of them. So whatever it's worth, times two, baby. I went to the tote. Christmas. Gold. I hope so. Tennis shoes. <laughs> Christmas? See? Merry Christmas. It's a whole Christmas tote of fun. Ain't no doubt about that. More of these. One, two, three. Whatever's in here is in here. Oh, yeah. Ryobi belt sander. Nice. Bostic. What is that? Some kind of. Yeah, like a palm. It's got to be worth cash, though. Yeah, I didn't see that. Once you got all these items, $20, $30, $40. I need to get my card. Oh, my gosh. Oh. 
I see some boxes I really like. We'll get there in a second. <laughs> I can't tell if you're you're grunting or smiling. Both. There it is. It's a happy, happy grunt. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. See? We're starting to get the stuff we need. Oh, yeah. Set the bus open that safe. We got two of them right here. We probably need both of these. Yeah, set those aside. We got hammers. Another toolbox is loaded with stuff. We'd have to give us some a little extra power. Look at that. Snap on. Oh, nice. Everything in here is money. The question is some, how much. Some more than other. Well, just sure value. Yeah, just volume, but. Oh, man. I'll sneak it back here. Look at this size. Holsters, mags, ammo. <laughs> Starting to like it. Yeah. Oh, hoo -hoo. I love sealed boxes. It's like Christmas, birthday, all in one. And the best is we're gonna be here all tomorrow. Wow. 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 So another box loaded with cash money. Forty, fifty dollar box easily. Maybe more. Okay, that's in the ammo box. Oh my gosh. Ammo. Those look like old bullets, don't they? Yeah. This is all 22s. Look at how old that is. 50 caliber. Wow. Balls? Ball pistol. 45 caliber. This is money. Money. Nine millimeter. More nine millimeter. Probably another forty, fifty dollars easily. But just this box alone could be a fifty dollar box because this is for a Winchester repeating arms company right here, forty five caliber. And just in the original box could be big, big money. So we could find firearms in here. Any I mean there's just anything could be possible in this unit. Anything. We've already found so much craziness. Oh, right there. Wow, that looks serious. Cold steel. GI Tonto. Oh, yeah. Gerber. Leather holster. More holsters, holsters, holsters. More leather holsters. U.S. military. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Holsters. Wow. Would you put a price on that last box? Those knives could be $30, $40 a piece or more. That one Gerber knife I know is money. So I don't know. Probably another $50 to blow in. Brand new stock for a rifle. That's a good sign. Really good sign. More cases. Oof. I don't like that. You're gonna find some photos. They can't all be empty, right, just yet. That's right. Oh my gosh, so many I think the full there. ones are towards the back. So real quick, we'll just go through some of the stuff on the shelf. We got extensions. We got hand, especially hammers, Mac tools, steel, firestorm. Two-way communication system in the box. Is that headphones? Yeah, this is like surveying stuff. Ryobi tools. There's a chainsaw right there. More Ryobi tools. The Walt tools. And I'm gonna get this out of the way. See all those cases down there. And start going up there. Or over here. Over there. Over there. <laughs> we have so much to do. Wow. Alright, got more stuff down here. This is a gun lock. I gotta tell you it's empty, but it still have money. Another gun box. So this one feels empty. Huh. An 
interesting for sure. This is not empty. What did you say about oh, oh my gosh. Look at that. Wow, wow, wow. So, Roger Brothers, brand new set. This, this is no rhyme or reason. You got empty pieces like this. This one don't feel empty. Battery in the thing in there. This is definitely not empty. I just don't know. Man. <laughs> this could be good. This could be good. Sports cards. Wow. 1989, 1990, 91. These are all cards here. soft case right here. So we find empty cases, full cases. Sockets. Tough box. No, nope. something's in the tough box. Mac tool. More tools. Empty box. Empty box. Empty. This is Makita Cirksaw. Nail Master 2. <laughs> so I don't know. It's like hit or miss. Some are empty, some aren't. Hand planer. In there. How nice that looks. Edger or planer? Planer. Roby. Dremel. Another Dremel. Whatever that is. That's a fish finder. Oh, yeah. An eagle. So, I mean, it's just. Oh, oh this is heavy. This is empty. That's a bunch of tools right there. It says Makita $89. Nice. So, <laughs> I'm just laughing because it's like half the stuff's empty, half is full. So like every time I think it's just all empty, then I pull out like this thing, oh, here's a $50 bill of hair, empty case, empty case, $20 bill of hair, $100 bill of hair. So, it's just funny to me. I don't know. Oh, it's in there. Whatever it is, it's heavy. It's heck. Hydraulic jack. Two and a quarter ton floor jack. Nice. So. Senko nailer. For flooring. Yeah. This looks like some kind of brand new bags or something. I see all these toolboxes, I see all kinds of cases. I'm right high charge. And this looks like it's all plastic bags. So, and right on here, I can see, I just, I just saw this now. Wow. We got pneumatic tools, cutting torches. I mean, in tools alone, we're gonna have thousands of dollars in tools. We're gonna find out in a minute. Depends on what's in all these cases. Are they all empty? All full? 50-50 like the last few? I gotta get my, gotta clean some stuff up. We'll get the cart. Let's take a look real quick over here. <laughs> Valentine's Day bears. More Valentine's Day. This feels like an empty case. Empty camera case. Electronic, Electronic charging scale. scale. I 
another one. Two for. Can we go for three? No. Craftsman nailer. nailer. I've had those before. Little digital signs. Yeah. Not digital, but whatever they are. At secondsense.com. Decorative stuff. One of our many, many tripods. Paper cutter. Whew. Air volume and control. Okay. Some type of plumbing piece. Brand new. <laughs> this thing. Interesting spot for that. Wasn't sure about that one. Quarter cable. Air nailer. Lots of tools on this side. Amazing. Socket. Amazing. Sockets. Sockets. Snake. The wall something. Skill saw. Right, another 20, 30, 40, 50 dollars, right? Yeah. Laser. Micro line laser. Self lining line. Self leveling line. Huh. Nice. I mean, it's got to be worth something. Yeah. Professional adjustable ladder in the box. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in there. What the heck is this thing? What the heck? Pride Silver Star lift ramps? Is that for a car? Yeah. It's still like a wheelchair or something. Oh, yeah. That would be worth a few bucks. There's uh -huh. something a huge underneath a, on a dolly back there. Oh, my gosh. Ammo box. Stickers. What the heck does that say? Say? What? Here. It's like, it's like a cash register drawer there. CDs. Cash register drawer. There's, key, there's keys there. Everywhere. Tons of keys. Smith and Wesson. There's a key. These are gun safe. You need to leave that drawer out. There's more keys in here. Bait and tackle. Wow. Wow, wow. Paperwork. 10 carat. Nothing in there. It says 10 carat, 89 bucks. So, does the safe have firearms in it? Does it have gold? Jewelry? Is it empty? Who knows? Mag. Gun, Gun accessories. Accessories. Oh man. Saddle carry bag. Oh. Oh, right here. Coins. Silver nickel. Oh, yeah. This could be really good. Really good. Nolan Ryan card. $100 price tag on it. 1947 MacArthur. $89 two piece set. Awesome. Oh man. Autograph baseball. Mystery star. Oh man. 
silver coin. One fine ounce of silver. American dollar. You like in this box? I'm liking this box. Gun stuff, gun stuff. That's for a Nintendo Game Boy. More coins, half dollar proof. That's not very open. Gold card. United States Special Mint Set. More coins. Spanish coin from the 9th, 1492. 1492? Yeah. It says $50 price tag on there. Wow. 67 mint sets. $40 price tag. Mint set. Wow. 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 Now we're finding coins, cards, autographs, locks. I mean, that's the box right there. A couple hundred dollar box. Over a hundred dollars, so easy. Man. Now I'm excited. What's underneath all this? One says ammo on it. Ammunition. 22. Wow. Shotgun. We got all kinds. Some of these are a dollar a piece. Just to let you know. So these are probably a dollar piece right there. It's probably like a twenty dollar box. Three eighty auto. Wow! 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 Remington stock. Wow! We got gun pieces, gun parts. Something that says silver plate. Oh my god, no way. Says Megs. <laughs> wow. These I think are like 10 or 20 bucks a piece. Three fifty seven. That's in there. You know, 20, 30 bucks a box. Yeah. Just another probably around hundred dollars in here. It's 399, 20 caliber back in the day. All different types of shells, cartridges, things. Oh my gosh, look right here. These are all gun stacks. Gun stack, gun stack, rifle stack. <laughs> Whatever's in here, it's heavy. Oh, so it's ammo. Tools. Alright, this is batteries. Batteries. What do they need all the batteries for? I don't know. They don't, I guess they didn't realize they're not going to stay good. Here. Whatever it is, it's new. Is it got a paper or something? Like labels or bags? Labels. Alright, what's in the case? What's in the case? Uh -huh. Come on. Come on. saxophone has a $369 price tag on it cool so we get two three hundred bucks for that maybe more so much stuff down here and it's all money it says pants 
Oh, the key's in it. Woo. I was gonna say, I know we saw those cutters earlier. Craftsman, Craftsman. All tools. All Craftsman. Look at the condition of these too. Yeah, that's a beautiful box. That's a nice box of tools. So, why don't you put a value on this toolbox? It's 100 bucks. That's the 100 bucks right there? Then we got some kind of testing equi equipment. No clue on that. And music television. Woodstock, Saturday Night Fever, ZZ Top, Police, great, Greatest Hits. Jefferson Starship, and I see a whole thing full. Looks like vinyl. Look at that. All right, got another instrument case here. Come on, be in there. Be in there. Yes! <laughs> Woohoo! Yamaha clarinet. $229. Nice. So we found two instruments right now. Both of them, that could be 500 bucks for two. <laughs> might make some money. So let's see here. Carpenters. Oh man. Grow plants. New York dolls. These look like they're in pretty good shape. You got a whole mixture of different type albums in here. So who knows? Steve Goodwin. Hot tuna. Ultimate spinach. I don't know, did you tuna. know? That's a good one. Did you know the Carpenters? That Carpenters album? Yeah. Did you hear after them that their mom and their sisters formed a group and were pretty well known? Did you know what they're called? What? Carpenter Ants. Bob Dylan's greatest hits. Even better. Did you hear his uncle Bob started Senior. a band? No. <laughs> Me neither. So we got a little bit of everything here. The Bee Gees. Stay alive, stay alive. The Moody Blues. Neil Young, Russ Never Sleeps. So another thing full of records. So probably another couple hundred dollars easily. Don McLean, American Pie. Singing, this will be the day that I die. This will be the day that I die. Oh, yeah. I ain't gonna worry about it. I mean, I gotta go up, I gotta go down, I gotta go left, I gotta go right. I think you have more empty ones up front, and as you go back, it starts to fill. So, I mean, we found so much stuff already. How many guitar, guitar cases are up there? I don't know. So we wow. found so much stuff. Nails. Hold on. I'm, I was zooming in on the guitar cases. So we found nice. so much stuff. Nails, screws in this one. We got tools. We got instruments. We got albums. We got new stuff. We got old stuff. Vintage stuff. Everything you can imagine. Ammunition. Nice. I mean, parts for guns. There's hundreds, hundreds of cases. There's tons and tons of boxes. I don't even know what's in the back, right? I don't know what's in the back left. Only thing I know that this unit is definitely loaded with cash money. $5,000. Just to say with the buyer premium, everything else, 6000 for the unit. All the expenses, another $2,000 some dollars. Jeff, another $10,000. I don't know if I'll make all my money back, but I know I'm having a great time. Hopefully you guys are having a great time. If you are, don't forget, hit that thumbs up, share with all your friends. Who knows what else we're gonna find in this treasure trove. But sometimes you take a risk, sometimes you gotta play big to win big. And today is that day. <laughs>